Uh, yeah, that, uh, the joblessness in the community, and as, uh, ghetto, and as downtrodden, and as last thing to do as nothing else that it seems it looks to be, the young men in the community, that are sitting around in the community not doing very much, not as acclimated to a justified society. Uh, rather about that, we can see uh, geologists, geograph geographers, land surveyors, you know, um, naturalists, uh, people, uh, biologists, insect, you know, animals, zoologists, all the people that have to sit for hours of time and watch things and write things down, and know how when it's going to come and go. That's, that's what they do. No one coming at the house, working, you know. Uh, sadly, right now they're breaking your home, know what time you're going to go, they watch the internet. See how skilled that is. It's a skilled, yet, a thing that the skilled thief is still a, a gift, a skill. I mean, a skill. So when we teach these people to survive in a uh, nurturing manner, and in a little rock school district has done that by teaching them geography, geology, then we see the people's gift to calmly sit and observe and to write things down and know what's going to happen in a spiritual cosmic manner then we have the people we need to move forward from those very points. You see, the answer to any uh, 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 fall of the city is in the ruins. And the ruins are the young people who are standing on the corner, pants down, joblessness, right? At the same time, the pressure from that, the hoovering that it comes, is that these careers that they are now pushing for has always been the answer. So let's use that gift, that start and finish product that we've wanted at this very time in our lives. See, that's the prayer that I've always, we've been always given, have always answered, okay? And I'm using it in another way, in another fashion, okay? Matching outfits outdoors on the outside or coming on the inside of your heart, beating heart. Clear all of that, okay? That's what these people are. Land surveyors, geographers, they can sit and watch things. They probably can sit and watch bugs, third ants all day and mark everything down precisely, which bug and all. You see, we can teach these people that so we have a scientific approach with them now so we can create income, international uh, income, based on an intellectual pursuit totally on an intellectual pursuit in the natural world which they are taught at birth they're given at birth now they're taught in elementary school so a surround sound education and we know that degree geoscience pays up to 90,000 a year so you get to have the world in, indoors and outdoors in your life so not all your time has to be spent in an air conditioned building to maintain your functionality, which goes against the natural process. And we know the more intellectual processes you, you receive, you're able to create things that you can use that don't have such a, such a destructive uh, energetic force, okay, in its life form, right? Saying that air conditioned buildings, when more people are involved in certain types of work, geology, geography, now we can create those areas through the uh, wind that it blows and different uh, cooling effects of placement and all of that. Then no longer need those uh, factors, destructive, uh, to have a destructive lifestyle along with it, with the cooling all the time, which is supposed to be naturally warm most of the time. So uh, inside of a building for eight hours can be a change of the gods with people who are outside of the working environment you see they can be brought into the working environment as the top level people starting from the ground level based on the destructive factors that what is being given to us right now okay 
I like that performance in the human experience because we're giving that when we're in a maximum security location. You see? All the time, that's what we are. Self-contained air bubble. Ready to maintain ourselves. Underwater, any pressure situation, that's what it's all about, okay? So, yes, let's be that. Let's look at these young people from way up above, okay? And now we've gone there. We don't have to go way up above anymore because we've established that that light is always is here now with us. So we can just look around and see that and see where they can be pushed there. Uh, same people I met on the way up, on me on my way down. See how beautiful that, that is now? It's much more loving, much more respectful, much more international, worldwide. Everyone can deal with it on that level. Thank you so much. All right, y'all. Oh, here we go.